What's up guys, Kenny here and welcome to another squad builder on FIFA 13 and today this is probably my most expensive squad so far, about 250k ish so we'll hop on straight in there so we've got gold, you can see we're playing in the 4-4-2 and we're going to go with Diego Lopez so I'll be honest guys, this team is shocking I lost all four games I played with it after I'd won I won my first three games in Division 1, bought this team and lost the next four, so yeah, that's basically it. Diego Lopez, he's average, I, I don't even really want to say anything good about him to be honest, because I just don't think he's even worth it. Um, PK, again, he's just too slow, good in the air, good on the tackles, nice passing actually, but again, just not good enough. I mean, I, I don't know what it was, because I've... It's a proper nice team, and after I've won all them games, I'm pretty sure it's, I've not just got bad at FIFA in like the past, what, few hours. It's a case of the team. You can see you've got Naxto Monreal at the back. That It's not Max, so he, You've got Ignacio Monreal. So he's got 81 pace. He, he was not a light player, actually. He didn't do too much wrong for me. Then at the left midfield, we have Pedro. Again, he wasn't too bad for me. 84 pace, 4 star skills, 85 dribbling, so he wasn't too bad. Centre mid, we have the best player of the team, Fabregas, felt pretty fast, nice passing, nice shooting, nice dribbling, he was actually a really good player. Then at the striker, we have the most overpriced player I've ever seen, Fernando Torres, we paid 47k for him, he's got 3-3 three and three, but I mean that makes no difference to me, he's slow, he can't shoot, he can't pass and he can't head. At the other centre back, we have Ogbonna. Good, good centre-back, one of the best players of this team. 80 pace there, 81 defending and 82 heading, you can see there. Nice little player and not too expensive. All right, right back we have Kasani, 79 pace, that's all I was looking for. And the strong link to the bonnet. Right midfield we have Pepe, again he wasn't too bad for me. With the 4 star skills, 80 dribble and 85 pace. Centre mid we have Marchisio. He had some nice pace on him, he had a nice little shot on him, but this team just didn't seem to work for me. And you're going to say I've got dead links all through the middle, well, if you ask me that shouldn't make a difference. And you can see everyone's there now on the full cam. We've got Balotelli, again, overhyped, supposed to be amazing, did nothing for me, I've got no clips with it. It was a really bad team, don't go out and buy it. But hopefully you've enjoyed seeing the squad anyway. You don't think this is too much of a bad video, so thank you very much for watching, guys.